Naglilinis ka ng toilet, you are not complaining because you know it's an opportunity. Yes. Right. Pero kung grabe naman sila dito. <laughs> <laughs> no, Nakatawa naman ng babae. <laughs> Pakita mo yung mensa na galing ka. Sobra naman sila. Mekos, mekos na to. We are complaining. We are complaining because no one paid the table. But do it heartily. Sabi mo, Lord, this is your house. What a privilege to clean for you. Amen. For your sake. And you will be rewarded. Amen. Amen. Are you listening, church? Amen. So when we look at this, when we think about this, It's all about love. And Paul says, if I do not have charity, but I, if I have not love to love in general, or to love the love of God and of Christ, if I do not have the love of God and the love of Christ, and the love which God and Christ exercise towards Christians, go and open your Bible. 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 11 to 15. Notice, this is the Apostle Paul pointed to us the love of God. Are you with me? Amen. Chapter 5, verse number 11 to 15. Notice what it says. Are you there? Amen. Knowing therefore the terror of the Lord. Okay, notice that. We know, we know how the word how, how the lord works right it says we persuade paul understand the import here it talks about the importance of the gospel the importance of telling people about jesus christ who died on that cross who can save people who can challenge people who can transform people and paul says this persuade us to persuade men But we are made manifest unto God. And I trust also are made manifest in your conscience. Not for the purpose of what? You see, ang ginagawa natin is not for the purpose of boasting. That's right. To show that you are good, to show you are talented, that you're the gift of the, the world, na ikaw ay hulog ng langit, na hindi ka tinanggap doon. <laughs> Mag-ingat ka, don't use that term. Okay? Hulog ako ng langit kasi hindi ka tinanggap. But, but don't, don't use your ministry for the purpose of boasting. Let God do the boasting. Amen! Right? Mas maganda yung sis bag, ang galing naman. But some say, o oh, nga. Kasi ito for the glory of God. Right. Verse 12, For we commend not ourselves again unto you to give you occasion to glory on our behalf, that we may have someone to answer them which glory in appearance, not in heart. For whatever we be beside ourselves, it is to God. Yeah. Or whether we are we be sober, it is for your cause. Verse 14, notice this. For all together, please. For Sabi ko yung uko na lang. Sabi naman kayo excited. For the love of Christ constraineth us. In other words, we are ruled by the love of Christ. Are you listening? So Jesus issue we the church of Ephesus had to do with the fact that they were not properly motivated when you read Revelation chapter 2. So they do something but they left their first love. So my friends, napaka-important. It's so important for us to watch our heart. So those who take the the, the word of God heartily will benefit. Tatlong bagay. Spiritually, socially, and physically. When you put God's word into your heart, This is what happened. It will benefit you spiritually, socially, and physically. So when we look at Proverbs chapter 4, 
verse number 20 to 27 shows us who we are. Okay, when you when you study verse 20 to 27, are you with me? Amen. This verse just shows us several things. Who we are, what we do, and don't do, and how we view and live life. So this is what chapter 4 means to all of us. Because notice, who we are, what we do and don't do, and how we view and live our life all spring from our hearts. Amen. Are you listening? Amen. So what do you do? It's matters of the heart. That's right. Who you are, spring from your heart. Are you listening? Amen. Kung ano ka ngayon, how you conduct yourself, Amen. how you behave yourself, spring from our heart. Amen. What we do and don't do comes from the heart. It all heart matters. So, to go to the point, let me introduce you. Amen. Amen. Bising na kayo? Amen. Ako, bising na. Okay. Okay na yung dyan ko. So, alam ko hindi ako makapasok sa point number one. So, let's all see what matters of the heart is all about. So, how do we know this? Number one. How we talk is a matter of the heart. Hello? Amen. How we talk is a matter of the heart. It is important to guard your mouth. Huh? It's important. Do you know the reason our tongue is behind our teeth? 